I got back as soon as I could. Lulu? Yeah, the guy at the deli sure knows how to move a line. I got pastrami and uh, black and whites. They had the big ones. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. You seemed pretty focused when I came in. I was thinking about home. Nicholas and Lucky are probably frantic. You should come with me next time. It'll get your mind off things. Oh, it's too dangerous. You should be out of the country, not in New York, taking care of me. We're taking care of each other. You're here because of me. And I'm starting to crack up. Don't say that. Why not? It's, I mean, I, I may be fragile and, and pathetic, but I can tell the truth, at least when it applies to me. Lulu's... I felt so much better after I talked to my mom. I thought Logan would go away. You're still in shock. But I keep telling myself that he's dead, and I don't really see him, but I do. And he's getting scarier, and... I feel like I'm getting worse and worse. Did I tell you the last things that he said to me right before he died? You'll never get over me. You should talk to someone, Lolo. I am. I'm talking to you. I mean a professional. We're fugitives. The cops have permission to use deadly force. It's not the best time for me to go to therapy. Okay, I know it's frightening, but just keep telling yourself that it's post-traumatic stress from what happened at Logan. You mean from when I killed Logan? It's not the same thing your mother... Really? We don't know that because I'm acting the same way my mom did when she lost her mind. Okay, that's why I'm taking you to see a doctor. Our faces are probably in every emergency room in the city. I don't care. Okay, I'm gonna get you help. Even if I have to turn myself in. Give yourself up. I need you to get help, get treatment. If that means that I have to go through a trial, then I will... Well, everyone's gonna think that you're guilty because you ran. You can't turn yourself in. Promise me that you are not gonna do that. Okay, the night that Logan died, you wanted to confess. I wouldn't let you. I covered the whole thing up and expected you to go on with your life as usual. Oh. I was trying to save you, and all I did was make your life worse. Oh, well, I'm, I'm feeling better. I, I, I'll be fine as long as you and I are together. You don't have to cover in front of me. No, everything will be fine. Just promise me we'll stay together. Okay? Johnny? Blew out when I turn on the microwave, and Sal usually fixes it. And I'm afraid I'll flip the wrong switch. Okay, well, I will fix the microwave, and uh, you guys can stay here and make some sandwiches. I just bought some pastrami at the deli. <laughs> We're supposed to be watching over Lourdes, right? And dinner's part of that deal, right, Lulu? Sure. It's crazy, isn't it? How it turned out so great for you and Johnny to hide out in Professor Siegel's apartment. We couldn't have done it without you. Thanks. The cops have it wrong, don't they? Johnny's innocent. Lulu. No. No! 